Hello everyone. Welcome to week four of your personal best. Now, challenge seven is agility. So we're really going to be looking at that endurance and that school value of perseverance. Now the first challenge, we're looking at jogging on the spot. Now who remembers those top tips? Good. Opposite hand and opposite foot work together. So as one comes up, the other one comes up with it. Okay? Just like this. Now, for this challenge, it's important to find a pace that challenges you. Okay? So as I start, uh, yep, yeah, okay, that's good for me. Now, for every minute I complete doing this, I get myself one point on the scorecard. Okay? Now, it's also really important to remember to respect your bodies. So, as soon as you're really tired and you're finding it more painful, then you just need to stop and then have a rest and then try again. Okay, if you want to simplify this challenge, all you're going to need is a chair. Whoa! Okay, I'm still looking at endurance and perseverance, but for this challenge, I'm swinging my arms instead. Okay? The scoring is still the same. Every minute I complete, I'll get myself one point. Now our top tip for this one is to keep your body nice and straight. So I'm not curling, I'm not cramping, my shoulders are upright. And so as I swing my arms, I need to continue to do this for as long as I can. Okay, for the super challenge, all you're going to need is a pair of socks and a cloth. So with these pair of socks, you're just going to separate them and you're going to lay one down on the floor. Now use whatever space is suitable for you. I'm going to take 10 steps away. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then I'm going to put down another song. For this challenge, you're going to have two minutes to complete as many laps as you can. Every time you touch a song, there will be a point. Okay? Now, all your top tips. Get down really low to touch the sock. Okay, so I'm not running and I'm not bending down. Anytime I'm near it, I'm going to get myself really low to the floor. Okay, let's go again. One, two, three. Just like that. Okay? Right. Shall we go to the sports hall and see who we can find to do this super challenge? Are you ready? You've got two minutes to try and get in as many laps as you can. Okay, ready? Go. Oh, good start. He's getting down really low. Well done, Mr. Warner. Go down, keep persevering. Gets tough after a while. Forty seconds gone. Right down there. Okay, you got one minute gone now. Keep on going. You've got one more minute to go. Squeeze in as many as you can now. Dig deep, Mr. Waller. Tough work. <laughs> Thirty seconds left. It's a tough super challenge. He's doing a good job though. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, 
two, one, stop there. Well done, Mr. Walla. You scored. Challenge eight is to make up your own. So this is a time for you to get really creative. So you can either take an old challenge, change it, adapt it to what suits you best. You can make it harder, you can make it easier, or you can think of a whole new one entirely, okay? Now, you also need to think about your scoring. So are you gonna do the activity for a certain amount of time? Can you last for that time? Or are you going to give yourself a time slot, one minute, two minute, and are you going to see how many points you can earn within that time slot? Now, I've been thinking about my personal challenge, so if you need a little bit of help, you can always use my one. So, for my game, all I need is a pair of socks, and I'm going to adapt the game to throw that catch. Okay? So I'm going to change the clapping into the game head, shoulders, knees and toes. So I'm going to throw a pair of socks in the air and I'm going to see where I can get to before I need to catch the socks. Right, let's give this a go. Ready? Head, shoulders, catch. Right. Let's see if I can improve this time. Here we go. Head, shoulders, knees, toes, catch! Yes! Come on! Right, let me see who I can find to play my game. No! Head, shoulder, knees, toes. There you go. Yes! Yeah! Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Yay! Yeah! Oh! Yeah! So, that are your first two challenges. We hope you really enjoyed them. Keep working through half term to see if you can improve your scores. We hope to see you really soon. Remember to stay safe. See you later. Bye bye.